All right, we're here and today is the first day. We're gonna take a look at our trailer after it's been in storage. And when I say in storage, I mean in the lot for a good three months. So uh, let's go check it out and see, uh, see how it's doing. So here's how she looks. Come on up here. Just take a quick peek around. Got all the stuff going on here. We got snow on the battery boxes. All right. Well, that looks good. Looks good. Got an icicle. Check out that icicle. Oh yeah, check it out. Well, that way you can see the gutters up there that redirect water away from the face of the vehicle. Uh, but I didn't bring my tools with me. I'm gonna check on the uh, the batteries and see how the batteries are doing. All right, so here's the tools that I have. Got a bunch of stuff in here. I got my crescent wrench, I got a measuring tape, I got sockets, I got a ratchet, I got a breaker bar, clamps, I got a little tool in there for uh, flushing out the uh, system. So all the stuff I think I'll need. But let's check these. Crescent wrench. Let's go with that. So it comes in underneath that and then it folds under this top part. Okay. Let's get this now. So I've got an interstate battery. Cool. Conditions look good. Everything looks, looks solid. Let's uh, let's get in here and check the voltage. It helps to be able to check things. You have a multimeter, so you can see how much voltage is on your batteries. Let's see. I'll probably end up checking just one battery because um, it was kind of a pain to open the other battery slot. Checking it out. Looking pretty good. I'll button this back up. Right there. So you want that to go over to the battery. All right, we'll get the strap back on. All right, there it is, all put back together. Now we can check out the rest of the stuff. Take this off, but first I wanna to check to see if the propane tanks are here. So it's got these little twist knobs on top. I recommend twisting them with gloves on because they hurt your hands otherwise. Okay. Yep, got both tanks. Yeah, still got both my, uh, both my propane tanks. Good, let's lock this back up. I use this ball hitch protector on here so that doesn't get stolen or whatever. Looks like it's looks like it's getting some rust on the top of it. And this definitely has rust. I'm gonna spray it with my anti-rust stuff. Why? Because I can. I happen to have a can of anti-rust stuff right here. So I really like this spray. And uh, I usually spray it on kind of heavy, but it helps protect things and it helps stuff stop from rusting. Spray it down here too. Basically anything that can get rusted. And I don't really care if it looks a bit yellow. Don't eat that orange snow. So yeah, so this is the corrosion inhibitor spray and it works great just on stuff that's corroding or whatever. Just went and checked on the roof. Everything looks fine. All right, trailer's looking pretty good and inside's looking pretty good. Battery voltages are okay. Sprayed some corrosion spots. Otherwise, looks good. I think we'll uh, be ready to check it out next month. Maybe we can take it out next month. Be exciting. All right, trailer's looking pretty good. And uh, I think it's time to wrap it up. Thanks for watching. And uh, I'll see you next time.